I want to read an article to you and let me say this first. I believe many of the articles or the things I type, I believe if you really pay attention to them, I think they will help so many people. Much of these things I had to learn. Maybe I should say much of the things I type, I had to learn the hard way. And if you don't have to learn something the hard way, learn it. Don't have to go through pain and suffering because you chose to not listen. So let me read this article, this message. And it is called, You Are So Superficial. You may believe you need to dress horse to get a man and for him to marry you. This is not true at all. In my opinion, when most men see a woman dressed very loosely, I don't believe they are thinking about marriage, right? If you dress in a very low level way, very revealing, expect to be cast away when they find no more entertainment in you. If you present yourself as trashy, in many cases, I believe you will be treated as such. Some people may get offended by this, but it is better to tell you than to not say it. Some people may have not grown up with good counsel from their parents. So, some people may follow what is popular, what is most popular to do. This is usually bad. Men, you don't have to boast about your possessions or bribe a woman to get her interested and be with you. What do I mean by bribe? mindlessly giving her money in the attempt to get her interested in you. You don't have to do this. If you start giving a woman money because you want her to be with you, how can you complain if she leaves you if you stop giving her money? Think about it. You started the relationship wrong, and how can you expect it to turn good? You can't really call her a gold digger. What's wrong with genuine interactions? It seems like dating is about baiting, showing someone something visual in the attempt to cover what's truly inside. Then you wonder how the relationship turned bad. Honestly, have you thought about this? What's wrong with having genuine interactions? Dressing properly and talking about your likes and dislikes with someone you are interested in, asking questions about them, so on and so on. Why do you have to show your butt to get a date? Why do you have to flash your money to get someone interested in you? Is this truly dating? I believe this is baiting. How can you have a genuine relationship with baiting someone. 
For instance, instead of learning about my personality, look at my breasts. Instead of asking me about my plans for the future, look at my car and my nice clothes. This is childish. This is not dating, but immaturity. How can you have a solid relationship when the foundation is based upon immaturity? If you do it properly, will you get as many people interested in you as before? Probably not. That is good though. By doing things rightly, most immature women and men may stay away from you, in my opinion. That's a good thing. No waste of time. Why waste time with someone when it is not going to work? Have you thought about this? You are sabotaging yourself based upon how you choose to meet a woman or a man. You are guaranteeing your relationship to fail. Get with a person because of what you noticed about their personality. Get with a person because they have similar plans to you. Get with a person because of reasons that are solid, which you can build on. Don't get with a person because of superficial reasons, unless you intended unless you intend the relationship to fail every situation may not be the same but aren't you tired of failing let's change god bless you